Hey super fans, it's Joyce here. Wanted to do a vlog in response to um, the questions that were asked about our new facility and I thought I would do a vlog about it um, just because um, it's easier to communicate that way and I'm just gonna film my dogs in the same process because um, they're much more entertaining to watch um, than myself. So anyways, first of all, um, the first question is where we are located and uh, when will we be moving to our new location? So location is super important to me um, as is our current location. Um, I wanted a place that was close to the airport and um, close to a major highway and the new location is no difference. Um, we are less than 10 minutes from the airport, um, which is actually even closer. And once the airport trail opens, we are actually going to be way closer um, than that time wise. Um, and we are as well on a major highway, which is Stony Trail. Um, the location itself has uh, no traffic lights either. So that's the joys of not having that and uh, wait for the train and to sit on deer for traffic. And uh, so it's going to be a bonus for a lot of people. Although distance wise, um, we are actually on the outskirts of the city. Um, time wise, we will be shorter distance for many um, an exact pinpoint of where we're going to be located without revealing the location is uh, we are about three minute drive east on Country Hills Boulevard um, off of Stony Trail in the northeast. So um, yeah, we're only a few minutes away from the airport tunnel, um, 10 minutes away from the Cross Iron Mills, and uh, even just a 20 minute drive um, from Auburn Bay. So for those that are not conveniently situated on Stony Trail, um, we will be introducing our first ever Sleep Rover shuttle, which will comfortably shuttle 10 dogs per trip. And I will do a quick little glimpse of our setup here. Each of our shuttles will be holding 10 dogs. Each dog will be in their own kennel equipped with their own memory foam bed. So they are protected from bashing into each other, barking, and uh, they are sitting in comfort and cleanliness. Okay. So for our shuttle, we wanted luxury and safety as the top key points. Um, we're not jamming 10 dogs in the back of a pickup truck. Um, so it's very similar to how we have our rooms um, where we have leather couches and luxury dog beds for our clients to sleep on. Um, our shuttle service will be just the same. Um, when are we moving? Um, we are hoping to move uh, by fall of 2014. Um, construction should begin in June. Um, why are we moving and will we have the same concept? So that's awesome question. Um, people want to see what the difference is and um, why we're moving. So number one, um, money obviously is always a big thing in any business. So we're excited to announce that we won't be increasing our rates and we have not since we've opened in 2009. So to top it off, not only will we provide everyone with the same rates um, as when we opened, um, we also will be able to offer a better product for everybody. Um, second of all, we have amazing staff, of every, as everyone knows. Um, so nothing compliments them more than having a facility to match them. So with our amazing staff, um, nothing compliments them more um, than getting a facility to match them. Um, we are excited to learn from our many poor decisions in our current place, um, such as having too thick rubber flooring, um, carpet in the foyer and feeding rooms, drywall separations, and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. So we're happy to be able to have a higher quality facility um, that will sustain all the party dogs at our new location. Um, our size will not vary as it's very important, important to us um, to maintain the personal t touch that we thrive on at our current facility. However, our setup will be modern and well laid out. From three rooms, we will be increasing our rooms at the six room mark so that we'll have two small dog rooms, one for super small dogs and one for the more rambunctious small medium dogs. Um, we'll have two rooms for the calmer large dogs with run, one room being solely a senior's room. And as you all know, we all have a soft spot for our seniors because they deserve the best. Plus two large dog rooms um, that if dogs are good can be also merged into as one large huge dog room.
Our most excited addition will be that each room will have their own yard. So no more loud letouts that you all hear every morning and at night of us trying to rotate overnight dogs with daycare dogs and three different rooms into one room. Um, Cause we all know that dogs don't like to take turns. They think that now is now we want to go out now. And um, that's when it gets pretty crazy. So we're looking forward to this the most. Um, each yard will all have access to a large off leash fence park as well. Um, we're excited Decided to offer off-leash days for our um, daycare and overnight clients. Something different for the dogs, especially dogs that stay for a longer duration. And all that noise is by this Philip. Hey Thor. With being on an acreage, there's plenty of room to run and fresh air to breathe. Um, the cleanliness level will drastically increase with a cleaning station to each room. And the yard will not be of mud and gravel, but grass. And when affordable, all artificial grass. We will also have a specified spa room with their own yard and an open, open style boutique, which will um, have our products well laid out in a more cheery concept. Um, I have attached some of our inspiration follow photos um, with this video at the end. Um, so our vision is, is, and so this is our vision for our new facility. Um, please stay tuned for more information and thank you for our, your patience during this growth spurt. Um, we promise to offer you an even better product to not be the biggest in Calgary, but obviously the best if we aren't already. Um, if you wish to know more about our timeline and more information, uh, definitely come visit us at the Pet Expo. Um, we'll have brochures and uh, we'll be able to answer all of your questions. Thank you.